Hey everyone, welcome to 20 at 2, where we will be learning some ASL vocabulary. Ooh. Hello, welcome. How are you guys doing today? It's Monday in New York. It's a little dreary. It's kind of drizzling and raining. It's windy. Um, there's some toilet paper in the tree across from where I live. I'll show you. Can I do that? I guess I can't. Oh, there we go. And it's just blowing in the wind. I've been watching it all day. It's kind of like my little friend. Like, hello, how are you doing? Sometimes at night I see it moving out my window. I'm like, oh, just my little ghost friend. Just saying hello. Like, hello. My little ghost friend. Do you remember the sign for ghost? It's spooky. <laughs> Ghost, ghost. Okay, so today we're, <laughs> I'm so silly. Um, I need contact. Today we're gonna be learning some um, nature and science words. And if we have time, we're gonna learn some animals too. So um, farm, farm is just that hidden country. So tempt, steal, punish, some of those hidden words are down here, um, but that can be farm. Also, um, we show the sign for beard. That can also be like farm or country. So if you're talking about a farmer, it would probably be farmer. But yeah, the farm or country. This is the sign for earth. You kind of say, this is the earth and it's rotating on its axis. Um, axis, sorry, axis, 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 um, axis. So that's earth, the sign for earth. I kind of like the way that feels like, oh, Hey, Earth. Um, earthquake. Earthquake. Like, it was really quake. And um, that's the sign for thunder. So, Earth, thunder. So, if the Earth is quaking, Earth is thundering. <laughs> yeah. Um, environment, circumstance, or situation. Um, left hand, or um, non-dominant hand up. And then the other hand just goes around it. So we're showing like, this is the environment or situation we're in. Um, so E hand is showing that's the environment or the situation. That's cool too. I like that one. You know, like what's the environment? What's the scene like? Is it hip? I want to be hip. Um, <laughs> this is tree, branch, forest, or woods. Um, so you just kind of show this is the tree. Oh, that was so like with the toilet paper in the tree. It was like this. This was, was the TP in the tree. This was the tree. That's a sign for tree. Um, wood, saw, or lumber. You're kind of sawing that. That's similar to the sign for bread, where you show the bread and the slices. Um, but wood or saw, lumber, that kind of makes sense to me. Like you're sawing something. You're going to build something creative. What are you going to make? What are you going to create? What do you envision? What is your ambition or goal? Um, Island, eye fingers, and then we show the circle of an island. I am a rock, I am an island. That was a popular song back in the day, before my time, probably before your time too. The sign for rock, rock, boom. So you like, <laughs> you're like, it was a rock and it was like this big. So if it was a tiny rock, you know, it was like that. If it was a big rock, whoa, big rock, rock. So I am a rock. I am an island. Show me that island. Yeah, that's it. You getting it right. You're showing that island. Yeah. Show me if you wanted to cut some wood on that island. Wood. If you wanted to eat some bread. If there were trees on the island. What kind of, what's this situation like on that island? That island situation. What's the environment like? Was there an earthquake? Maybe there was an earthquake on the island. Maybe it was kind of like country. Was it country? Was it like a farmer? Maybe you became a farmer on your island. Um, ocean, water, waves. So around the island, there's a lot of ocean. And maybe if the, if the island is large enough, there could be a river. <laughs> so we have uh, water, 
going by, just a nice little river, maybe a stream perhaps, if it's an ocean, that motion of the ocean. Um, <laughs> I'm in such a silly little mood today. Um, the, the sign for um, like stream, uh, fountain or spring, um, kind of like two sea hands and then so the water just kind of bubbles over. So that's like fountain or spring. Did you see that beautiful water fountain? Oh, I sure did. It was beautiful. It was a beautiful fountain. <laughs> Don't you think so? Um, if there was a storm, whoa, you just kind of um, circle your hands. That's similar to the sign for, do you remember what the sign was? Oof. Do you remember? Do you remember? Ooh, what's this? That's a sign for worry. I'm worried about something. Oh, I'm just worried about it. And that's similar to the sign for storm. Storm, gale. That could also be the sign for cloud. Cloud would probably be a little more open. Um, but yeah, storm, worry. The sky, if you just want to show like, oh, look, the sky. Yeah, you just kind of make a little arc and just show, that's the sky. It's above me. Sky. Yeah, hello, sky. Yeah, um, let me, I want to do the sign. I'm not going to tell you what it is. I'm going to see if you can interpret just by um, understanding like context. Um, do you know what that is? Hmm, what could that be? It's a rainbow. We have color sky or color arc. Yeah, so if this is sky, and then this could be color. Yeah, color arc, awesome. Up here, we just draw a little circle. That's the sign for the sun. Sun, if we wanna do sunshine, sunshine, sunshine. Oh, the color for blue, or the sign for blue is blue wiggle. Yeah, that's the sign for blue. Um, yeah, so sun, shine, um, this is a sign for moon, it's like a crescent, you're like, hello, I'm the man in the moon, hello, you have the, um, you have the sun, you have sunshine, you have the moon, oh, Torian, that was a fun guess, though, I'm glad you guessed, but you were wrong, wrong wrong. It was not correct. Correct. True. Right. Yes. Correct. Correct. You were wrong. I'm sorry. Uh, let's see. Oh, so sun. You don't have to. <laughs> every time I'm talking about the sun, I'm like leaning, but you don't have to lean. Sun. Just draw a little circle. Sunshine. Moon. We learned this one when we were talking about hell, where you point down and then the flames erupt. This is the sign for fire. Yeah. This is the sign for electricity. I like to think of it as being like the plugs. Um, if it's two boy plugs, though, you can't really go together. Um, but yeah, electricity, um, also the sign for physics. Um, yeah, so electrical lines being brought together. Yeah. Um, you guys are doing so great. Uh, we, so we, moon, the man in the moon, the crescent moon, you can see his eye. Um, stars. Whoosh, whoosh. To me, it kind of looks like it would be the sign for firework, but it's the sign for star. Just kind of showing like shooting stars. Um, yeah, yeah, fire, moon, stars. We have... Oh, now we're going to get into some, um, so do you remember the sign for year? We, we showed that a year went by, so year. We're going to do some circle signs now, which um, we'll kind of all, all do together so we can kind of learn them as a, a, a group. But this was the sign for year. The sun was going around and coming back, or the earth was going around the sun, the sun was going around the earth. However you want to think about it from a, you know, a, a physics standpoint, uh, physics environment yeah um so <laughs> back to my um my collection of signs that circle around the hand universe u the letter u 
and it just comes around. So if you want to talk about the universe, yeah, that was the universe. The world is W's circling around. So yeah, the world. Oh yeah, many people in the world. Um, also, we have orbit. Orbit is just one finger going around. Like, oh yeah, we, um, like this is the little space shuttle just going around a planet or a moon and it lands. Yeah, orbit. Um, and then this is um, variety, kind, sort. Um, these were, uh, they just kind of circle around. Circle around. So kind, variety, sort. Awesome. This is the sign for machine, engine, factory, mechanism, motor, something that makes something else work. It's machine. Um, so maybe the sign for mechanic would be like machine person. Yeah, machine. Uh, the sign for rocket or missile. <laughs> yeah, so the R sign gets launched. Yeah, so maybe the the rocket had an orbit, or maybe a planet had an orbit, but yeah, maybe it was a satellite. Um, things that you find in the Earth, dirt. So if you're looking in the world, the world, you could probably find some dirt. Um, you might find a diamond, the D hitting the ring finger, diamond, 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 diamond. It's like a rock or stone, rock or stone, diamond. Awesome, now we have gold. So gold is kind of like a yellow earring, yellow and earring, or not earring, but we're just showing that like, oh, a gold earring, silver, S. So yeah, earring, silver. If something creates a shadow, this was the, the color sign, the color sign for black. Yeah, so black covering is a shadow. Black kind of cover, uh, palms facing each other. Yeah. Science, biology, chemistry, experiment. I kind of think of it as a like a mad scientist pouring test tubes. Like, ha, 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 ha. So science, biology, chemistry, experiment. Yeah. Awesome. You guys are doing so well. I think we're going to have time to do some animal signs. These are fun. A lot of them are pretty self-explanatory, so I think we'll be able to move pretty quickly through them. Um, horse. Uh, we have the H, and it becomes an ear. Do you remember, this was the sign for donkey, stubborn, um, or mule? So it's kind of like that sign, horse. That's a sign for cat. Cat. Cats, the musical. You're showing the whiskers of a cat. Yeah. This was the sign for, like, burglar, thief. We're showing, the, like, the fake mustache of a burglar, a robber, or a thief. Uh, this is the sign for cat. You're showing the whiskers. Ooh, the whiskers of a cat. Dog? You're calling the dog. Oh, yeah. So a dog, actually, rather than going like, rough, it's, um, you snap and then hit your side. Dog. Like, come here, boy. <sighs> Tiger. We're showing the, f the stripes on the face. Tiger. You show a couple times. Tiger. Right now, there's a popular show called Tiger King. King, we show that sash. King. Tiger King. Lion. You're showing that cute big mane. Lion. Deer. We show the antlers of a deer. Deer, elk, moose. Kangaroo. Kangaroo is just a bent hand hopping by. Oh, look, it's a kangaroo. Hello. Oh, look, it's a baby kangaroo. <laughs> This one's in the pouch. <laughs> Giraffe. Sea hand. Ooh, and you're just showing that how long that neck is. Giraffe. Bear. A bear could scratch you. 
You get it scratched by a bear. A bear. Zebra. You're showing stripes. Stripes of the zebra. This is the sign for fox. It's also the sign for sly. So if you're being sneaky or sly, similar to the sign that we learned for like odd or weird, odd, weird, um, F for fox. And it just kind of goes by the face. Yeah. And they have that little, those cute little pointed noses. Hello with their cute little nose. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying hello to everything. The toilet paper in the tree, the, the, to to the foxes. Hello, little fox. Um, monkey or ape? We just kind of do the monkey or the ape. Boom, boom, ba -dum, boom, 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 boom. Elephant. We show the trunk. Yep. A rabbit. We show the ears. So this becomes the rabbit head. These are the ears. What was this one? Bear, yeah. What was this one? Lion, yeah. Um, skunk, you're showing that strike with a uh, K hand, fingers pointing down. So you're showing that stripe, that skunk. This is the sign, it could be duck, but it's actually dinosaur, showing that long neck of a dinosaur. Not all dinosaurs have long necks, but yeah. Oh, good, Emily. Yeah, Emily guessed that it was bear. She was correct. You were correct. You were not wrong. Good job. Uh, dinosaur. Goat. Um, you're showing just the horns of a goat. I love that in our day and age, if someone says goat, it's the greatest of all time. Like, oh, he's the goat. So that could be the little sign for goat. Sheep. Um, you're showing, um, cutting, this is the sheep's head and you're cutting its wool. So that's a sheep, uh, sheep or lamb. Yep. Cow, showing little ears, little ears or horns. That's the cow. Pig or hog, we have, um, yeah, pig or hog. Uh, or mouse. You're showing that cute little nose. Cute little nose of a mouse. Rat is the same as mouse with an R. Rat. It's a rat. He's a cute little mouse. Rat. Cute little mouse. Pig. Yeah. What is this? Yep. Sheep. Goat. Very nice. Bird, it's like a little beak. Owl, big eyes. Reminds me kind of like binoculars. I'll check to see if it might be the sign for binoculars too, but it's owl. Um, eagle, showing the hook nose of an eagle. So instead of tweeting, eagle. A duck gets two. So bird is just singular. If you see a, a duck, you do two, yes. So duck has a larger beak, so two fingers. Turkey, gobble, 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 gobble. that turkey neck. Turkey, mm, turkey. Rooster is up here. Chicken or hen, so you're showing a bird that pecks. Chicken or hen. Can you guess what that one is? It's turtle, <laughs> turtle or tortoise. You might see those on your personal island. Turtle or tortoise. Frog, ribbit, 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 ribbit. When a frog, <laughs> yes, you got that right. Correct, correct, it was turtle, yeah. Um, frogs have those necks that expand, so that's frog. Fish, you put your left hand on the wrist and then you swish that tail. Um, I'm trying to find like a good angle, but yeah, fish, fish, yeah, very nice. Fish, snake, oof. Um, it just slithers out of its cave. And uh, bee, bee like lands on your face and you swat it away. Oh, bee, ugh, we don't like bees. 
Mm -mm. So a bear scratches you. A butterfly just wiggles beautifully. It reminds me of the sign for glory. Glory, glory. So yeah, butterflies have a lot of glory. They're not like bears. They're not going to scratch you. Spiders. Spiders, the eight legs of a spider. <laughs> I have the most frightening fingers. <sighs> spider. Worm. <coughs> bug or insect. They just like to fly around your nose. Ugh, bug, insect. Similar to the sign for lousy. Lousy was three fingers, the sign for three on your nose. Ugh, just lousy. Things can't go right for me. It's lousy. Lousy insects. Ugh, those lousy insects. Fly is a sign for get with on your hand. So this is a sign for fly. Yeah, fly. Um, and then just one more sign for today and then we'll be done. Um, and that is the sign for flowers. Your flowers, yeah, you're, mm, you're smelling them. Oh, they smell so good. Yeah, flower. Uh, if you wanted to show like a flower or yard, you would show the space. So it's like, this is for like garden or yard. So you're like, oh yeah, that space. You know, there's a, this is the parameters of the garden and there's flowers inside. Maybe you're, I'm sorry, I'm gonna teach a couple more. Maybe you're um, blossom or blooming. It's similar to the sign that we learned for spring spring the season spring blossom or bloom blossom bloom and then one more sign and that is two more signs um this is the color green so that's grass yeah so green grass green grass so just together it's grass spring grass. And then the last one, it's similar to the sign that we learned for dirt or soil or ground, um, but it's the sign for um, plant. Oh, I'm going to plant something there. So you're sprinkling the seeds on the ground. Yeah, awesome. And maybe you have to clear away all the rocks or stones. You might have to saw or cut some lumber, um, tree, there could be an earthquake, Hey, I'm going to post this on YouTube. If you want to review these words, feel free. Um, the link is in my bio. I'm so grateful to have just be learning, to be refreshing all this ASL. I'm so glad you guys are doing it with me. I hope you have a wonderful day. We'll be back um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday of this week for 20 minutes to learn some more ASL vocabulary. <laughs> Bye, you guys. I hope you have a good one. Aha,